welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm bringing you my long-awaited Primark haul. Since I put up my last video, you have been excited for this Primark haul. So here I am. I'm going to show you the bits that I picked up in that vlog. Just basically show you the nice bits that Primark have in at the minute and the things that caught my eye and that went straight into my basket. Without further ado, let's get into this haul because I think it's going to be a long one with those two massive bags. So if you do enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, make sure you follow me on Instagram, and let's just get on into the video. If you haven't watched my little Primark vlog, then make sure you go and watch it. I'll leave it linked in the description down below. So the first thing that I have in this bag is this beautiful dress. I love the thick straps. So it's just this stripy long bodycon dress. I think it goes down past your knees. But I thought this with like a little cardigan over the top um, on a nice summer's day with my Alexander McQueen's would look so so nice. It's a bodycon dress so it like cinches in at the waist and then obviously goes out at the hips and then it goes right down past your knees I'm sure. So I got this in size 8 and this is what shocked me even more about this dress. I thought it was going to be around £13 maybe because it's quite thick material. It feels such good quality. But it was £6. £6. Like, this is what I've missed. I've missed Primark and I've missed their prices. The next thing I have is a piece that I just think will be so handy. It's this towel like dressing gown thing. I don't really know what you call it. I don't know what it's called. Don't know the actual name for it. So this is what it looks like. It's baby pink and it's got little these little straps on it. Um, and it velcros at the front. So you basically like wrap it around you once you're out of the shower. And I just thought this would be perfect for when I've got out of the shower in the morning and I'm getting ready, like doing my makeup, doing my hair. Because I never like to get dressed until my makeup is done because I get scared that I'm going to get makeup all over my clothes. So I never get dressed until my makeup and my hair is done. So this is going to be perfect for that. I cannot wait to try this out. I hope it works in the way that I want it to work. But yeah, it's just this lovely baby pink. It's towel material. Um, of course, so I'll probably get out of the shower, dry myself with a towel first and then pop this on. I got this in size extra small slash small because the small slash medium looked a little bit big and this was £7. Next thing I got in here were these lovely cute pyjama bottoms. They've got little thumpers on and I just love the colour. It's like this beigey colour with a baby pink trim and a baby pink little bow, got little buttons down the center there. And yeah, and then they're cuffed as well. I have to have pajamas that are cuffed. I love cuffed pajamas. I cannot wait to wear these. These look so comfy. So yeah, I really, really like these. They're even cuter that they've got a little thumper on from Bambi. Got these in a size small, which is a size 10 to 12, and they were eight pounds. So the next thing's in this little bag. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna rave about this right now. This foundation is incredible. I got one in my last Primark haul, which was in February, and I'm obsessed with this foundation, like absolutely obsessed. I've got it on today. Uh, it's just insane. So if you can go to Primark and pick yourself up this foundation, do it. It is literally five pounds. It's the most full coverage foundation that I've found that's like drugstore price. It's like a frosted glass bottle. It looks so sleek and so nice. And basically, it states that it's double coverage, matte foundation, long wear, matte finish, and oil free. It also has SPF 15 in it. And I can say that it lives up to what it states on this bottle. It's definitely double coverage. The coverage of it is insane. And yeah, it's definitely a matte foundation as well. In the vlog, if you've seen it, I did say that they didn't have my shade, which is normally light beige. So I did have to pick up the shade Toffee this time. I picked up two because I just thought I love the foundation. So if I have to like lighten it or darken it with either another foundation or a concealer, then I will just do that. I just had to pick them up. I've really been into painting my nails at the minute and doing them myself at home. So these are my newest ones that I've recently done. They're just like this baby blue colour. 
and yeah, they're just so cute. Primark had these colours of nail polish that I just loved, so I picked them up. So these are the three shades that I picked up. This is the blue that I've got on my nails at the minute. I'm obsessed with this colour blue, and that was a pound. That is in the shade Eggshell. I then picked up this one, which is like a nudie taupe colour. Um, and then that is in the shade Barely There. And that was also a pound. The last one I picked up was this one, which is a pinky shade. And this is in the shade Blush. They're basically the Gel Effect Long Wear and One Coat nail polishes. So, yeah, I really, really like these. They're so good. They, they applied really nicely. So I'm quite glad I applied it before I filmed this video, just so I could tell you if they were good or not. And I can definitely say they were good. So these are my nails. I really, really like them. And then the last two things in that bag, I picked up a pair of eyelashes and a pair of nails. I don't actually know why I picked these up because I didn't really need to. I have recently bought my own little tips from Amazon. That's how I've done these nails here. Basically putting the tips onto my nails and then putting the gel over the top. And it's worked out really well. It basically looks like I've got acrylic nails on when I haven't. Um, they're just fake nail tips and gel polish. I don't really know why I picked these up. I think I must have just chucked them in my basket without even realising. But it doesn't matter because they are actually a really pretty colour. I'll get my wear out of them, I'm sure. I'll just wear them one day when I just want something quick on my nails. Maybe when I'm going out and I haven't got time to do these. Because these do take a very long time. They took take me about two hours to do. These are very time consuming, so these will be perfect for when I just need to shove something on my nails and I can just stick these on. So they're like a coffin shape and they're in the shade Stone. I just like this nudie colour. Primark didn't have my favourite lashes, which are the GWA ones in like the princess lash, so I was absolutely gutted. So I just picked these up because I thought these looked quite nice to like play around with so I, I've never seen these in Primark before either they're called party lashes so I thought they'd be nice to try just try a new pair and um, when I next go back to Primark I'm hoping and praying that they have my princess lash in they're the lashes that I wear all the time so that is that first bag done now we're moving on to the second bag which is the biggest one this one's huge and it's very heavy so the first thing I have is this pair of shorts how cute are these shorts I saw them and I just I was like I do need a new pair of denim shorts for when the weather is nice not that it's nice at the minute because in the UK now since we've had that heat wave the heat has totally gone and it's so dull and raining now but it doesn't matter, we always get a bit of rain after we've had a good bit of weather. So hopefully next week it looks like it's brightening up, so I hope I can wear these. So these are the shorts, they're just these light blue wash denim shorts. They're ripped and like torn, which I really like that look. This is what the back looks like. So they are super high waist shorts, I got them in size 8 and they were £12. I love the fact that it's got belt loops as well. Some high waisted shorts that I have don't have the belt loops and I love putting a belt with an outfit because I just think it makes it look so much nicer and complete. The next thing I picked up were this 7 pair of low cut trainer socks. Always need socks and I got them in these gorgeous pastel colours. Obsessed with pastel at the minute, as you all know. It comes with a grey pair, a light green pair, a like beigey yellowy pair, a lilac pair, another grey pair, a nice baby blue pair, and then a pink pair. Seven pairs of socks there. You cannot go wrong with Primark trainer socks. I always get my socks from there, and they were £2.50. Bargain. Next thing I picked up were these pair of culotte trousers. They look a bit like pyjamas on right now, but I just thought these with like a nice white vest top tucked in, a nice white fresh pair of trainers, um, sunglasses, like, oh, I can just imagine this outfit on a really hot day. These trousers, because they're so flowy, they like have flowy legs, that's what clock trousers obviously are. I got these in size extra small, which is size 6 to 8, and they were £8. So I cannot wait to style these up. So the last clothing piece I picked up were these white 
pair of cycling shorts. I might wear these with like an oversized t-shirt. Like I think this with a nice oversized graphic t-shirt will look actually really nice. But white wasn't my first choice of cycling short. I really wanted another grey pair and some more black pairs. But literally the stock was so limited. I don't know if it's because they hadn't had a restock for ages. But the only size in cycling shorts in black, green, I think they had, and grey were large and extra large. The only cycling shorts in my size were these white ones that I picked up. So... I just picked them up because I thought, why not? I'll probably regret it if I don't. And they're only £2.50. £2.50 for a pair of cycling shorts. And these are so much better quality than Pretty Little Thing. I have two pairs of black ones from Pretty Little Thing. And you can see my pants straight through them. So I got them in size extra small, like I've said, and they were £2.50. The next few things I got were hair accessories. So I picked up these gorgeous scrunchies. How lovely are the colours on these scrunchies? So it comes with a nice blush pink, a nice purpley grey colour and then a khaki green colour. I love these for hairstyles like when I've got half up, half down or even when I just want to shove my hair up. These are just so nice to have in your hair like just as an added accessory. So I got them and they were two pound for three. Next I picked up two more of my beloved material headbands. I love these things. My favorite hairstyle at the minute is to put one of these in and just curl the ends of my hair. That is my staple at the minute, it's my go-to hairstyle. Alongside with my two clips in my hair as well, that is one of my staple hairstyles too. I needed to pick up two more of these because the two that I have are getting very, very well loved and I'm just scared that they're gonna end up like snapping sometime soon. So I just thought I'd be prepared and pick up two more. So I got a grey and a black one and they were a pound. And then the last hair accessory I picked up were these clips. So I picked up these clips just for when I'm doing my makeup and I want to put my hair out my face. These remind me of Jordan Lipscomb. I think she had them. I think she's used them. There's been quite a few other YouTubers use them as well just to get your hair out your face when doing your makeup. And I just really like that. So I thought I'd pick up these ones. So you've got two animal print ones, a baby pink one and a black one. And they were £1.50. On to the last little bits now. I'm gonna go on to like the cosmetic bit. So I picked up my Cool as a Cucumber face wipes. I've not had these for ages. So I really wanted to pick some up. I'm obsessed with my simple wipes still. I swear by those. But I just wanted to pick up these because they smell so, so good. And they're just so good for taking off the majority of my makeup before I cleanse. So that is why I like using wipes. I then picked up my oval cotton pads because we all know I have to pick up these in every single Primark haul. They are 90p a pack. So 90p for 100. So I've got what? I've got 200 here. Cannot complain with that. And yeah, I love these for my cellar water. And then the last cosmetic thing that I picked up were these buds. So these are perfect for my makeup when I'm wanting to tidy my makeup up. Um, they have like, I don't know if you can see in there. But they have like a flat side on one side and then a pointier side on the other. So these are perfect for when I need to tidy up like mascara getting underneath my eyes or if I need to tidy up my wing on my eyeliner. Yeah, so I really, really like these. 80 buds for 80p. 1p a piece. Can't complain with that. And they come in this really cute little case as well. So, yeah. The last few things now are from the home section. And would it be a Primark haul if Ellie didn't pick up some candles? Of course, I picked up my tea lights. I love these. Since being in lockdown, I've gone through all of my tea lights in my room. So I really needed to stock up. So I got my favourite scent, which is clean cotton. Can't go wrong with a clean cotton scent. They just smell so, so good. And they make your room smell so fresh as well. So you get 24 candles in this pack for a pound. And then I also picked up another pack of 24. But these ones are in one of my favourite colours. These are in that lovely lilac colour, as you can see. Same colour as my phone. 
Um, these are called lavender silk, so they're lavender and chamomile. Yeah, they smell really nice as well, but I got them mainly because of the colour. And then the last two things I picked up were two candles. So this is the first one. It's in this really, really cute gold candle holder. I really like the gold rim around the bottom. This smells so super nice. It's wild bluebell. And yeah, I can't wait to burn that. But I really got it for the pot. And then the last candle, of course, had to be one of my favourite colours. You're probably all sick of me saying that now. But yeah, it's this beautiful bluey purple colour and this matches the tea light. So this is also in the lavender silk, lavender and chamomile scent. It smells really, really nice and fresh. And yeah, I basically got it because of the pot. So that is the end of this video. I really hope you did enjoy it. I'm so happy to be back with my Primark hauls. If you are as well, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up. I love every single thing I picked up and I know I'm going to get my use out of it. If you haven't already, make sure you go and watch my Primark vlog, which was up before this video. That just shows you basically what else Primark has to offer and just so then you can see, if you haven't been already, what Primark has in store. That's it for this video. I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Make sure you go and follow me over on my Instagram. It'll be on the screen right now. I basically post on there every single single day and I'm always updating my stories so make sure you go follow me over there and yeah I'll see you in my next video bye everyone <laughs>